the quick uh, video of comparison of two uh, fish finders. It's uh, with regard to mega imaging uh, for the fish finder. Mega imaging is basically using a um, 1.2 million hertz um, sonar instead of the uh, the lower um, like um, sonar frequency of 350 uh, kilohertz or the uh, Hummingbird or the Lorenz or Simran or the you know typical sonars that use only about 455 kilohertz uh, or uh, the 83 or the 5200 kilohertz like you see here and Raymarine um, use 350 kilohertz but they just um, are about to come out with this 1.2 uh, megahertz um, million hertz um, sonar that's why it's a uh, mega imaging and this um, um, imaging technology is going to change the game or actually make the um, underwater structure uh, more um, clearly but the price tag as you can see here are a lot uh, higher certainly I'm not comparing the seven inches or the nine inches uh, those can be uh, you can still put you can probably get the seven inches for about eight hundred dollars but the uh, nine inches are probably going to be uh, fifteen hundred dollars but uh, if you want the ten inches or twelve inches you're looking at the price over two thousand dollars for each uh, for one um, you know they're so expensive um, but um they're good to have if you if you can afford it so um, let's uh, go see um, before we delve into it let's see um, what the um, if you google the mega imaging uh, technology of fish finder you are basically going to see just one name which is the hummingbird they actually came up with the mega um, imaging fish finder back in um, 2016, almost three years ago now, and the they were the only one who came up with the mega imaging uh, fish finder, and um, I did look into it. I didn't. Um, think it's affordable to me because it either has the side imaging as you can see here or the down imaging as you can see here there's never a 3d imaging in um, their system or their module um, not only that um, you don't you don't even have one unit that has everything like down imaging side imaging 3d imaging you know but yeah they do have the mega imaging so and the price is not cheap but um, um, last year when I first uh, started looking at the um, yeah Raymarine one and um, they they have the 3d and the price is um, you know a lot more reasonable uh, or cheaper um, you know that's why I went with the Raymarine um, brain and um, so now they are uh, Raymarine was actually acquired by the FLIR um, company anyway so they, they're gonna come out come out with the element uh, Raymarine element series of fish finder but uh, it's gonna have the what's called the hypervision sonar which is the um, mega megahertz or million hertz um, sonar frequency to give uh, a better um, a clearer um, um, imaging of the river or the lake okay so this is called Raymarine element and that's what we're uh, comparing today let's uh, minimize this and go to the table I prepared so first thing first you can see um, the model is Raymarine element they have the 7 inches 9 inches and 12 inches and hummingbird um, they, sol solace they have the 
uh, 10 inches and 12 inches. Um, the price tag is uh, 24 uh, 30 or 29.99 without the uh, Navy Attics maps. The maps for GPS is an, another 50 to 125 dollars or you know additional. Same thing for uh, hummingbird. All these fish finder do not come with the um, to the price I'm showing here does not include the map and you need to get those maps um, um, remember to get the units with the maps the other thing you need to notice is the um, when you buy from online uh, stores um, like West Marine or um, Bass Pro Shop you need to remember the product uh, you want to buy it includes the transducer okay so they always sell these uh, uh, fish finder with without the transducer and with without the maps so you want to make sure you get the maps too um, so this way you can use the GPS otherwise it's a waste of um, money to buy this kind of um, um, products just like you're buying a um, 4k television and uh, you're not subscribing to the uh, or you're watching a video um, disc that doesn't have the 4D, uh, 4K, you know, capability, just like, a, um, you know, that's a waste of money when, when the machine has that kind of capability, but you're not using it for that purpose. So, remember to look um, carefully when you purchase the product online um, or in the marine store. Make sure you the product has the transducer included and the second thing is the maps so this way you have the GPS um, to guide you when you're on the water uh, whether it's lake or river and the resolution both 12 inches have the 1280 times 800 okay um, and the, the uh, megahertz both are 1.2 okay hummingbird does have the um, what they call the mega imaging plus I'm not sure um, that plus uh, meaning the megahertz is you know 1.4 or 1.5 they didn't disclose that but um, you can see mega imaging at 1.2 megahertz is side imaging down imaging and the 3d imaging uh, the hummingbird 12 is either the side imaging which the price tag is three thousand thirty one hundred dollars and you know if 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 it's down imaging only then it's twenty two hundred dollars as you can see this 2400 price is right in between the two but it has a 3d feature so um, as you can see in this uh, category here Raymarine does have a better um, advantage over the hummingbird and the transducer is hypervision 100 for Raymarine and the hummingbird is XM14 HWMS-T MSIT um, oh this is trans. This is transom mount um, transducer. This is not the through hole transducer. The Hypervision 100. The through hole they use a different uh, model HV 300. I think, you know, same thing with this. Um, Hummingbird does have an advantage of what's called the 360 imaging. Um, the Raymarine does not. So that's the advantage if you want to go with the Hummingbird. Um, so this way, um, you just need to add a, a transducer, a 360 image transducer. I think it's about 400 or 500 dollars uh, last year when I when I was looking at it. It's not cheap. This 360 imaging actually provides you the live view of the fish. Um, typically, these kind of transducer are mounted on the front trolling motor of your boat. So this way you can see the crappies uh, swimming around in uh, lifetime, okay, in, 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 in life. Um, so it's not a past uh, tense uh, view. And um, the other advantage of Hummingbird is the touch screen. It does have a touch screen. And because it's a touch screen, that's why the power consumption is a little bit higher, 35 watts versus the 25 watts. And... Um, um, the sonar frequency, as you can see here, Raymarine has the 350 and the 1.2 versus uh, Hummingbird. It is more 
uh, they give you more frequency so in that category uh, hummingbird is a plus um, that's pretty much it for uh, comparing this mega imaging fish finder between the two companies and um, I, I think I will I, I lean towards more to the uh, Raymarine element but uh, I know people um, um, want uh, better clarity and I would think um, because of this even though this is 1.2 megahertz but because this is imaging plus they say it's about 20 percent more of the the clarity is 20 percent more than the uh, than the first generation of hummingbird uh, with the 1.2 megahertz so um, you know I would think hummingbird in this megahertz category is a, you know slightly better so let's recap this thing price wise Ray, Ray Marine is certainly uh, a, be a better choice resolution the same megahertz I would think Hummingbird is a little bit better. The uh, functionality of the Mega Imaging Ray Marine is in a better category because it gives you all three views imagings instead of just one. You know whether it's side imaging or down imaging, and Hummingbird doesn't even have the three uh, D imaging. Um, and then uh, 360 Hummingbird uh, is certainly is is a better winner. Uh, touch screen Hummingbird. And uh, sonar frequency, um, hummingbird, and the power consumption, Raymarine, because you know, um, this way you can have a, a you know, a, 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 you know, a smaller uh, ba a battery to carry uh, when you're on a kayak. That's the advantage. I right, here you have it. Okay.